Hey guys, how you doing? We got another M8 ammo mule going to Colorado for a gold mining expedition this summer. Basically, it's got the fuel box lockable. It's got two locks on the fuel box. Uh, you can hold one propane tank and four jerry cans inside there. And also it holds the, uh, it's a little bit taller, 18 and a quarter inches tall. It holds the uh, Rotapex cans. It's got the 7,000 pound uh, cables. It's got a detachable hitch receiver, so you can put the max uh, coupler hitch on there if you want to. It's got a thousand pound tongue jack, amber LEDs. You got the D rings, and it's got hooks two, four, six, eight hooks on the back, plus on the tailgate as well. Um, you just see these fenders are reinforced. This is a five lug on four and a half inch bolt pattern uh, with brakes. It's got three inch axle, rated at 7,000 pounds, 3,500 pounds, spindles and hubs. Um, the fenders have an extra uh, gusset in here, so they will do not wobble. Very strong. You can walk on these, no problem at all. It's got the tailgate. Straps are, can come off. Totally detach the straps. One thing I will add to this is the rear hitch. Still got to add that, but this rack is adjustable. Just remove the bolts and I'll let the customer drill the holes wherever they want to. But I think we're going to do something. I think we might raise these up and put some bolts and wood panels to that. But uh, LED tail lights, heavy duty hinges, 10 hooks so you can tie a tarp down to it. I like to leave these open right here so you can put you know poles inside here or wooden wooden or steel and make a little shade area you can put your chairs down here and put a tarp over that so kind of left that open for that reason you got a lot of tongue space put an ice chest on here there's the VIN plate right here, and also there's another VIN plate underneath the trailer hidden in case you need to uh, prove that it's your trailer, in case somebody takes it and takes that VIN off there. There's another VIN number hidden under the, underneath the trailer. Uh, these things are fairly light. You can just lift it up and, and uh, sit, it'll sit right on its back bumper. So there you go, guys. The next one going to Colorado. Thank you for watching. Ask any questions you want. Email m8a1mule at gmail.com. Thanks.